This jump demonstration will show you how to navigate the jump interface in Microsoft Windows. When you first open Jump, you'll be presented with the Tip of the Day window, which contains helpful information for new or even experienced Jump users. You'll also be presented with the Jump Home window, which helps you quickly access recently opened files and currently open windows. For example, one of our recent files was the car physical data, and if we open it and launch an analysis, the car physical data table and its associated analysis have been added to our window list. We can see a preview of either the data table or the analysis simply by hovering our mouse, and we can click on either one to be taken directly to that window. Jump data tables and analysis windows also have handy navigation tools in them. We can click the Home button in the bottom right corner to be taken back to the Home window. In any data table, we can see Open Graphs and Analyses on the bottom, and double-click to be taken to any one of them. And at the bottom of any graph or analysis window, we have a button that will take us back to the associated data table. If we'd like to view a group of windows side by side, we can check each of those windows in the bottom right corner, and then select Arrange Selected Windows to have Jump automatically arrange them for us. Note that each window in Jump has its own Jump menu and toolbar, though depending on your settings, these may be hidden. If that's the case, you can view the menu and toolbar by pressing the Alt key on your keyboard or by hovering your mouse where the menu normally would be. We can specify whether we want the menu and toolbar hidden by going to the Preferences and setting the Auto Hide Menu and Toolbars preference in the Windows Specific group. The preferences allow you to set many default jump behaviors. For example, under the General group, we have a number of options for specifying which windows appear when we open jump.